Hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to Flea Market Decor's weekly flea market finds. I'm Kristen Dowding, the editor of Flea Market Decor Magazine. And for this week's videos, we're gonna be talking about some great flea market steals, which is always a fun topic. Our first video, Risa Richardson found not one, but two three-piece furniture sets for $30. Incredible. This is part of my fabulous find today. Okay, I have two three-piece sets and they are made out of wrought iron and wood, real wood, y'all. When I tell you these things are heavy, they are heavy. They are very heavy. Now, I got these from the flea market. They were $30 for the set. Next, we have Lala Life, who found a great deal on some milk glass. She found some amazing pieces in varying sizes and shapes, and the price tags are still on them, so you can see what a good deal she got. And of course, I had to get some milk glass. <laughs> Not a lot, but I do have a few pieces. For two dollars, how can I leave it? This little guy too. Wouldn't this piece look perfect with some tulips just draping over it? So excited. Or napkins too, for a dinner party. Um, I've never seen this little vase before. It had like those little knobs at the bottom. But I thought it was pretty cool. Of course, Mohab now. Then next, I have a fun surprise for you guys. Our exclusive paint partner, Dixie Bell Paint Company, has shared a video with us on painting a new, or on painting an old piece of furniture with new paint. Um, for this one, the painter is using three different shades of the same color for kind of an ombre effect. So go grab some paint brushes and watch this next video. So for my flea market find this week, I found a really pretty painting, some flowers. They're in muted tones and it's an original painting. It's got some nice texture on it. And I want to use it for my vintage flower gallery wall. It's been taking me a while to acquire the right number of pieces. Uh, whenever I find something from a flea market, I want to come home and like hang it right away or put it where it's supposed to be. But for these, I am just piling them up in the guest bedroom until I have enough to put on the wall. Um, and I don't like the picture frame. So uh, I think I can easily remove this. As you can see, it's a nice thick canvas back here. And then I just have to take, um, take off the nails and then it'll easily separate. So I'll have this nice piece by itself. Uh, the reason I've been having such a difficult time finding these paintings is because of the color palette that I choose. I like nice muted tones and earthy tones and a lot of the flower paintings that I found have had lots of bright colors in them like reds and yellows and oranges which are great uh, but for me I wanted something that's a bit more um, natural looking so I was really excited about this one. Oh and I got it for ten dollars. The vendor was asking fifteen but I asked if I could have it for 10 and he said yes. So that was exciting. And that's it for this week's videos. I hope you enjoyed the paint tutorial as well as some great bargain deals. And you can tune back next week. We'll have some more videos for you.